So this is basically a definition of a slink. So the main canopy is connected to the risers, which is connected to the main harness by something called a slink or a soft link, which is essentially a piece of cable that is looped on, it, on itself and then finger trapped into place. If a person had to tamper with, slice this away with a knife or pair of scissors or remove it altogether, they only need to tamper with one of the four line sets for that to cause a malfunction. The reserve parachute has the exact same system. Lines connected to a reserve parachute connected by a soft link to the risers. When you're ready for your skydive, you either take your own harness or a borrowed or rented harness, um, which has a reserve parachute and a main parachute in it. It's a dual system. The only part that you would check is to ensure that your three rings are connected and that your chest strap, your reserve and your cutaway handle are in place and your leg straps are serviceable. There's no real way to be able to check to see if those slings have been removed or tampered with as not even checking kind of opening the harness would you be able to see if it had been tampered with skydiving is a very regulated sport to ensure the safety at all times of all participants certified riggers have to check and pack the reserve parachutes every six months in south africa for somebody to have tampered with the gear, which meant, would have meant that they would have had to have taken the reserve out, tampered with it and returned it back again. To ensure the safety of your gear at all times, we rely on our riggers, our certified riggers and our packers or ourselves to make sure that our gear is in workable order.